Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Hypixel Skyblock Grinding to Terminator. So, a few days ago there was an update to Skyblock. I made a video on it and that one did pretty good. Thank you to all of you guys that watched. And today I'll be testing out the, the part of update which I think was the best, which is the Crystal Hollow update. I, I, I don't think they're even the same update, but whatever. But the update just buffed powder grinding to a insane level because now the great explorer unlocks the locks on the chest for you and if you max it out it just unlocks it instantly for you and you only have to right click on it so this video will be me doing a test of how much powder can i get in one hour so right now i will be setting a a timer of 15 minutes and uh, if you guys don't want to watch my process of grinding just skip to whatever time appears on the screen right now all right and the time starts now all right so basically you find a chest it doesn't you still have to touch it you have to right click on it in order to unlock it. And my goal right now is to get to jungle. Because you know, even though sludge's price went to from went from like four thousand per to one thousand, it's still some money, so you know. And what the heck happened to my mole perk? My mole perk. Oh wow, look at this, this is so fast. Wait, do I have... Okay, I still have enough money. Oh, but it's not even times two powder of end yet. And I accidentally did it. I click on the gemstone when I wasn't supposed to. And that was a grave mistake. Because if I did that when it was like times 2 powder, I could have gotten 10,000 instead of just 5, you know. This is illegally fast. Uh oh. I can't believe one day I can just tap open these chests. I really can't believe this is true right now, you know. Because I used to have to do this. And if Skyblock lacks, uh oh, you gotta do that whole chain all over again. This is so much faster. I can grind like 10 million powder in like a few days. Well, maybe not 10 million, but like 4 million in like a week, definitely possible. And by the, like 4 million a week, I mean without me going crazy. When I was uh, grinding to 3 million, I was going actually crazy. Like, it's just mentally draining for me. Okay, we're already in Mithril Deposit. Oh, look at that. We already got 15,000 powders. This used to be not possible. Let me look at how many time has gone by. Three minutes, 15,000 powder. That is crazy. Okay, if I just mine very close to the edge, it should be faster. If I have more power, then I can just not ruby farm and just jump into jade, uh, jade farm, jade mining, or like, uh, 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 nobody's gonna watch this part anyway, so I'm safe. Sapphire, there we go, sapphire mining. Yes, no more digging around, but just, you know, 
finding the mines of Devon, which is a little bit better than, you know, just digging around in the magma field. And I can sell, also sell my uh, ball pet. Uh, so that I could, you know, I can just use the B pet because it's better than, you know, a ball pet uh, when you are uh, J mining or sapphire mining. And it's literally like the second, uh, the second best mining pet right under Scapa, which, you know, really do say something. And if I sell my ball, I think I will have enough money to get a Max Cell, a Legendary Griffin, and a Daedalus Axe, so I can do Diana within a few days, which is also very profitable. Alright, we're in the jungle now. I'm trying so hard. So far, I've gotten like 20,000 powder without me going insane, which is insane. <laughs> Wait, how much is Ascension? 1.1 <laughs> point. Nobody likes you, Ascension, bro. Thousand, let's go. That, that's a jackpot. I will say that is. Ah, oh, gone with the wind. Now it's possible for everybody to mine, which you know is a great thing. But I'm so afraid that it's gonna crash the gemstone market. But you know, whatever. I mean, this is like so much better for Iron Man player, to, to be honest. Because, you know, now they can suffer less from grinding powder and spend their time on something that they need to grind for. Which is very yeah, good. Uh -huh. This is so much more efficient. Now I'm feeling like a mining swap. <laughs> Just a uh hunt. -huh, yep. The right click. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Alright, look at me. I'm shaking my camera a lot. That means uh, I am a mining swap. Look at this. We almost got 40,000 powder? What, what? Okay.
All right, we have 40,000 powder, and that took us um, uh, 10 minutes, I would, I would just say that, because right now we still have six minutes and 30 uh, uh, seconds left. But we will just say 10 minutes. Ah, uh, this saves so much time. It's so much more efficient. Why? Why three of them? I mean, I guess they stack now. But I still have the versions that are not stackable. Uh oh, I'm wasting time, but like, yeah, the, these are not stackable. Maybe the, these will one day become an exotic. Who knows? This is insane. I think time is almost up. Uh -oh. Where, where, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, there we go. And another one here. And another one there. And another one there. Okay, we have three minutes. Another 1,000 gems of powder. Where did it spawn? Where did it spawn?
center minute left. And that's time. So for those who skip ahead of time, welcome back everybody. And for those who have watched the whole thing through, thank you very much. So I think we started off for somewhere around like 30,000 powder and we ended up to have 86,000 powder, which I would say we gain around 55,000 powders. And this is under the condition of no uh, double power event, which even if it's uh, 55,000 powder every 15 minutes, what the f oh, nope. It's 220,000 powders an hour, but if it's double, then it's 440,000 powders an hour, which is very insane because on on my final day of gemstone powder grinding uh i think it was like last week on sunday i just decided to you know power through the whole thing and it took me like five hours and three back to back uh two times gemstone powder event to actually get like around 200,000 an hour and then I took another two hours to get like you know the rest which is like another 200,000 which you know almost broke my mind but you know this this is very okay and we are going to go back to hub and see how much profit we have made from 15 minutes now this data might be inaccurate due to uh uh the fuel tank thingy because i think i already have some in my sack which can lead to inaccuracy but you know we made 300k from oil barrel okay i guess i clear all of those out all right okay so 1.5 i mean like around 1.4 but you can make around five to six mil an hour just powder grinding right now, even with like the current nerve. So very good, very good. So yeah, guys, in conclusion, this update is amazing. And you should definitely powder grind if you uh, wasn't, you know, before this update, because the, you can get to four mil powder. Uh, if you can get like, uh, times two powder event like every time you mine which is not really possible but let's just say it could happen then it will only take you 10 hours because you know 400,000 times 10 is 4 million I hope I'm not wrong yeah no there's no way I'm wrong but you know if you're not lucky then it will only take you 20 hours which compared to before I think I did like 30 40 maybe 50 hours of uh powder grinding and i got to like four mil so you know it's definitely way better so uh, yeah go do it right now go do it right now all right i will see you guys in the next episode goodbye